finally figured out what wrench it was I needed. It was the one with the stone gear in the centre and three iron around the outside. Well, I won't do wrong in the testing, I've already made one. But that's the one you want. Right, what we are going to need though is. Uh, let's get two sets, what the hell. A couple more gold pipes. And we're going to turn a few of those into conductive pipes. Bound to need them, so we turn the whole bloody lot in. What the hell? Right. Now trot down here. Hmm. I think I've got some more gold water pipes on me. So we'll have a look at them. Right, that's all in position nicely. Um, Alright, have we got any. So a block of cobblestone to stand on. I'll keep putting these up and take. Putting them on and taking them back. Right. One, two, three, four. They're waterproof pipes. Why am I using waterproof pipes? I'm an idiot. I wonder why they weren't connecting. Where's the ones we just made? The conductive pipes. There we go. Always works better when you use the right tools. Three. Okay, we'll join them along the back. Okay. Right, that should definitely. Well, I need them for water pipes. One, and well, I should have more than that. Right, so that's the top ready to carry our electricity off. We're going to need to run redstone to set the signals up, to set the actual switch on and off. But, uh, that's that bit. I'm going to bring water in through the bottom, and fuel will be coming in down the centre. It should be one, two, three, and at the end of there, ready to go into our refineries, which are going to be there, taking oil from there. Looking good. Right, this is sort of the design I like. It's nice and compact, generates plenty of power. Um, right, so here's our three over here. So, one. One, two, three, four. That should now be filling up the motors there with a liquid. Whoops, get out of there. Mm. Now I've got to get around the other side. To, uh, hmm. Do I want to? I'll go up there. Okay, I'll go over there. I'm not going to go up the other side here. Alright, um, where are our motors? We've done this side, haven't we? We're just looking at the other side now. We'll come over here. Yeah, they should be. Up here. Let's have a look. This should be our three motors. Yes. So we have our three more water pipes here. Two, three. And that should fill these three up. That, oops, I want to get out of there. Thank you. That should pretty much deal with uh, the water problem. We'll go and check our motors, make sure they're working alright. Oh, they're not working alright, but they're filling up water okay. Uh, no. The old spanner, let's just use the bag, I think. Right, you, plenty of water. Yep, they should all be exactly the same. Water's flowing in to the bottom, power flowing out from the top. Fuel flowing in from the side. I suppose we better go and get our fuel system set up. A refinery. And do we want a fuel tank? Hmm. If this is a bit compact here, I might have to go over here a bit more and make things a bit bigger over here before we move stuff back. I want to give it some thought and I'll be back. Okay. Hello again. Right, I'm back. Let's uh, start work on our. F uh, Refinery, shall we? Right, I think first thing I'm going to need is a couple of additional pipes. I think these are from the Bill Craft additional pipe one. And these are valve pipes. Wooden waterproof pipes either side, lever in the middle. Nice and simple, very, very useful pipe. I'm going to have a couple of them. Um, I'm going to need a couple more, well, a few more golden conductive pipes. And possibly a few more 
golden water pipes just to make sure. Right, next thing we're going to need. I know I count. It's, uh, I don't know, maybe OCD, I don't know. But uh, we need three tanks. It appears my voice frightens some people. I actually, it frightened Jesus, which is quite impressive, really, <laughs> thinking about it. Um, we're definitely going to need another cog. And we want it wood. Um, we want it stone. Not a cog of gear. We want it iron. <coughs> Same old thing. We want it gold. And last, but definitely not least, we want it diamond. Right, I think I'm also going to need for this a couple of redstone torches. Oops, three, come on. Right, let's just build up. I think, if I remember rightly, it goes like this. Oh, spot on. Not that I checked it about 10 minutes ago, but never mind. Right, that's pretty good. That's all very good. Right, before I do anything else, I want to stick my battery back in recharge. It's getting a bit low on power. Oh, there's not a lot in there, is there? We'll cobble that up. Have I got any coal on me? I haven't got any coal on me. Hmm. Right, okay, let's cheat up some coal. <laughs> Just for ease of use, save me walking down the stairs again. Uh, I'll put redstone in the middle, that'll give me fuels. No, it won't give me blooming coal. Maybe I didn't let teach it coal yet. Okay. Save cheating, we have to walk down the stairs again. Uh, right set of stairs will help. Uh, now where did I put them? Dust and powder, I think it was. Yep, yeah, we'll have them. Alright. Pop back up. What we'll do is we're going to give some to our generator. As we've got coal on us, and it seems to have stopped, it's going to give some to our coal cabin. Ooh, looking good, looking good. I've cleared this out a couple of times, but tend to forget it is astronomically slow. <coughs> right, yeah, I'm sorry if my voice is scaring people. Um, it's nothing intentional. It just is what it is. And this might, despite spending nine, well, the equivalent of about hundred dollars on the American users to try and get a decent mic, I'm still having problems, and I'm pretty much certain the only way I'm going to cure them is to um. What do you say? Invest in a well, not invest. Totally move my computer system around. I think what I'm getting is just too much feedback from the actual PC. Electrical disturbance, which is really annoying. I'm a sh I thought that DC offset, um, what do you call it, setting would hopefully cure that, but it appears it doesn't. Oh, that's a little bit of copper coming in. Right, let's try and work out what we want to do here. Right, I know what I didn't do. I need to build some more tanks. Well, I need to build a fuel tank at least. So we'll do that. And it appears now I've reached that certain point with YouTube where I can actually upload longer videos. Which uh, I quite like the sound of, really. Not going to be big enough, really, but it will do to start with. I can always make it bigger later. Right. Uh huh. Come along here, and I think we'll put a fuel tank over here. One, two, three. That'll do for a minute. Right, so now we want one of our valve pipes. Uh, darker side, the side it's pulling out from. Uh, where do we want to put. Right. Well, we're going to take that. Hmm. I want to come into the back really, don't I? So that only comes out. I can't. Yeah, these valve pipes are lovely. They don't go around corners. Let's go a bit further, I think. Don't you run out of power on me? Alright. So if I use. 
use. Go walk the bike there. 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 If I put my refinery there, there. If I put my refinery there, it's not going to be pretty, but it will work. And getting power shouldn't be a problem. I'll just take them all there. Okay. So now, oh, this drill is definitely running low on power. This drill is running out of power. Right. I'm going to be right back when I'm charged up. In a minute. Right, <coughs> that's better, fully charged up. Okay, first things first. Ah, again, I can't do that, can I? Right, what I'm going to do is a valve pipe there. Yeah, we'll do this like that. And come down to the water pipe. Cross there, cross there. Across there, up there. Right, let's get our fuel to there. I think I can put a lever here. And it should actually work. I'll find out. That definitely should work. Right, yep, that works just fine. Right there, let me get out of here. Right, that's all working just fine. Now we've just got to work out our electrical system. And then tidy it all up. Okay, so if we come across here, there you go, I'll pile the top. I should take you guys well from here. Uh, should we go one more? That will bring us in line with that. Yep, lovely. Right, let's have a use our conductive pipes. Right, one there. One there, one there. Uh, yeah, fine, I won't. There, there. Uh, is that line there? That one. There. And there. There we go. Right, that should be power getting to our. So that should be power getting to our um, refinery. I'll tidy all this up in a bit. I'm sure he's like walking around, I don't know what it is. Right, now, if I bring my fuel pipe to across to here, right, as soon as that starts working, we should, in actual fact, get something. I'm not sure about that valve, uh, that um, valve pipe there. I might just replace that with a normal wooden pipe and put a valve pipe on here instead. Oh, I'm thinking about that. Oh, scary noises. You know, one with my scary voice. <laughs> uh, I really don't want to be scary. Well, I don't mind scaring people. What the hell? I might even put Lord Raven away and let something nasty come out to play. <laughs> mm. Okay, right. Well, I'm going to grab some... Uh, oh, actually, I'll do that on camera, I suppose, because I haven't shown you how to make redstone wire yet, have we? And I do believe we have some sitting in here. Ah, oh, look at that. Redstone ingots. Well, I love redstone wiring. LRM, as far as I'm concerned, is a goddess. She is. Oh, will you stop doing that? She is brilliant. If we put three of these red alloy ingots in, we get some redstone. What's that for? We get some of that. I'm going to get two lots. I want to make sure. I'm going to trot down and wire up the V6. This is brilliant stuff. It goes up, down walls, all over the place. And it has a lot further. Now there might be a problem. I will figure that out. Actually, I don't really need to go down now, hopefully. So, what the hell? We will close it. Right, let's uh, start running our wiring. Up the wall. And we're going to do the same on this side. Where I'm dropping where I'm standing. Up the wall. That's there. And I think that would be a nice place for a, a lever. There would be a nice place for a lever. Now, I'm going to affect that one. 
I don't think that about this. Oh, no. Yes, I have. Let's put a lever down here. There we go. And I'll shut my engines on and off. You can see, all lit up nicely now. Damn, it's like easier and prettier. <coughs> Sorry about that. I'm just putting redstone everywhere. Don't worry about these. There's something I'm thinking about to do with the sorting room. But that should be pretty much ready to roll. What we will need is a little bit of basic fuel. Let's take a couple of buckets out. And we'll give our engines some fuel. And so, you. Oh, don't know why. We're not brilliant. It'll, do for a bit. It'll get things started, hopefully. And if all is cool, then. Hopefully, we will start producing. What doing? Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh -huh. It's uh, going to be one of those days, is it? Right here. You. I left the bucket now, didn't you know? That was clever, wasn't it? Never mind. We will get it there then. Thank you. And here, bucket. Right. Two more. Bring it here. Valve pipe will bring everything up to the same levels. One more. Right, we have connections, we have pipes, we have fuel, we have various bits and pieces. Ah, one more thing I have forgotten. It won't work very well without a feed. So what we're going to have to do is put a lever on there. Boom. That's it. Opens that up. Open that one up. Okay. All is cool. Our oil is flowing in. Ah. One more bucket. Think save from aggravation. Now why have I not been able to access that? There we go. Oil coming in from both sides. That stops everything weird and wonderful happening in the tanks. Right. Okay. Now, this is either going to go all right or all wrong. It's working. It's bumping power. The refinery is working. It's got oil. It's producing fuel. Well, as far as I'm concerned, that looks like a success to me. Ah, uh, what we'll do first. If we'll take you back off a little bit, we don't want it disappearing down that pipe. We might need to take them engines off and put them back on again. Uh, let it actually go. Yes, everything is working just fine. Right, well, we're going to let that run for a little while. And uh, we'll be back to see how we've done. Well, I had produced some fuel when I came back. The engines had ground to a halt, so I turned them off. We produced a bit more fuel than this, so I sort of got a bucket and gave them one each. Not enough to fill all the engines, so I thought it would be a better idea than to give them one more bucket to work through. I have changed this pipe, because I suddenly thought about it. There's no way gold water pipe will pull the fuel from the tank, but this valve pipe will. I'm not going to turn it on quite yet. But I think it's time to turn the engines back on, and they've all got a bucket of fuel in them. Yep, and look at the fuel. Alright, looks like she's put the right button. We should have cooled down enough by now. Right, oil's a dirty fuel. These should be producing a nice clean fuel. Uh, believe me, this is getting 10 times more power than it actually needs. I think that blue bar testifies to the fact it's getting plenty of uh, power. I turned our pumps back on to top our oil up. And I'll leave them on for the minute, they aren't doing them any harm. Right, well, that is our Buildcraft power supply up and running. We'll be using it in various machines and bits and pieces. Uh, but I think I'll let it run. It should be quite a lot on a bucket of fuel. Shouldn't do any harm. And hopefully that will now, well, should hopefully at least half fill that tank, I would have thought. Yeah, it seems to be topping up quite nicely at speed wise. I'm tempted to put another tank on top of that, which I probably will do off camera. And uh, now I suppose I've got to decide what I'm doing next. Well, we've got our red power sorted out. I'll put a few more battery boxes up there, but that'll be our red power running and a few more solar cells. 
Uh, that will do off camera. You've seen me do it already once, so it's not a problem. We've got our build card power supply. I think what we might have to do, or what we should do really, just to finish off the uh, full thing, I might forget this idea. And I think this might be a nice place around here to put our IC2 power supply. That way we've got all our power sorted out. I might keep an eye on the build craft room to make sure it doesn't go bang. I like doing that. I'm then going to want to go off in that direction and build a bit of a build craft uh, construction area really. I want to uh, get some lasers going and manufacturing tables. And I want some gates. I don't mean the garden variety. So, hmm. Okay, I will be back to uh, start a new build. I see two power, I think. See you soon. <laughs>